certain categories of spend, like the contribution of the pension fund, and I would argue a contribution to the rainy day fund, from the bottom of the balance sheet to the top. Mm -hmm. Right. So when you're building a budget, we need to start with what are the actuaries saying we have to put in there, what's the extra payment we're going to make or we're going to budget for, what's the rainy day payment going to be, and we'd like to talk about that more, but as a nod to the volatility of the revenue stream, and then build everything else beyond that. Now you can divert from that thinking in an economic downturn and when there's a crisis, but the general rule of thumb really should be that. You know, budget for your obligations first and then build everything from there. Um, the rainy day fund piece sort of is directly related to all this because in, in a state like Connecticut where we have arguably a, a progressive income tax, the volatility built into that is extreme. So uh, folks making under 100000 the volatility in that 